It is the 25th of December 2021 and today I'm vlogging. No, you see actually I lied, it's only the 16th, but we will get to the 25th soon. However, first let me take you back to where it all began. In London. You see, recently I have become quite a bit of a Londoner, shall we say. So I felt it was only fitting to go and take a stroll around the city during Christmas time because it's all pretty and festive. And do you know what festive times have? Balls. And then I also touched some feet, but let's pretend you didn't see that, okay? I, I did not touch any feet, okay? No, that, that was not me. So, moving on quickly, let me distract you from the situation and so that you forget what you saw. Now, because you have eyes, you might have noticed that this is a freeze frame. And that's because I cannot show you the rest of the footage because it's purely just too violent. And I still wanted to keep the festive spirit of the video. Moving away from the violence, we went to more violence on Bond Street, 007. With which I had to take a picture of, or because obviously my name is 004. No, it was not inspired by 007, but you know the link is still there. Swiftly moving on to Covent Garden, we saw the big tree. It was a very, very big tree. Here I am not doing any signs. I am purely showing that it's a big tree compared to me. These are not any signs. Do not take it the wrong way. The tree was just big. But then out of nowhere, I had a sudden urge of confidence and the need to be the center of attention. So I went up to the talent show little guy and I was ready ready to be the part of this act. But what did he make me do? Hmm? He made me stand on a rope. He made me stand on a rope. I stood on the rope. You know, I thought maybe this is gonna go somewhere, maybe I'll get some good content out of it, but no. I stood on the rope for a good 10 minutes. After five, I started to really question my life choices, so I had to quickly make some decisions, and I made the decision to run. I swiftly made an exit and found myself a boyfriend in the meanwhile. Then I also found myself four more boyfriends. Cute. Then I found another two boyfriends. Cute. They are all inanimate objects, but you know, let's not focus on the details here. Then the next tourist attraction was the London Eye in London. Crazy. And guess what? I found myself another boyfriend. Then, as it started turning into night time, I headed to Trafalgar Square. The next morning, I hopped on a plane and made my way to Hungary. So, the third day, which is Christmas, is quickly approaching on us, and so I thought, let's vlog it. This is my last Christmas as a teenager, as a teen. <laughs> I'm not sad about it at all. I'm actually not depressed. I am, I'm living my best life. Anyways, as I said, I'm vlogging today and I am not in a festive mood or spirit just yet. But I think since it is my last Christmas as a teen, I might as well make it worthwhile and, you know, try at least attempt to enjoy some of it. I know it's going to be difficult, but we might as well try. First of all, to get the festive spirit going, we went to Christmas tree shopping. We went to like four different places, four places, to find the perfect height, the perfect thickness, juicy, needly, green, tall, did I mention tall and thick Christmas tree. In the meanwhile, yet again, I did find myself more nutcracker boyfriends. I do love me a good nutcracker, as you can see, because I crack nuts as well. <laughs> Yours. Then once the tree was secured, I put it on my hinge and the strong back and shoulder, and I carried it all the way to the car.
Here is me stuffed in the car with the tree, with a quarter of a car seat left for me to sit on. It was indeed quite a rough ride, but you know what? We made it home. Now, the next task was putting the tree in its stand. And in case you've never brought a real tree, the stand and the tree will not automatically fit, which means that you have to cut the tree yourself. So that's exactly what I did. I got my saws and my axes and I cut it up. Oh my Jesus. Yes. Oh, I'm, I'm a bit busy right now. Sorry. Sorry. We're doing Sorry. I think she wanted to um, convert me into Christianity. I feel like I feel really sick. Three. I actually think I'm gonna. Chris Those more? Sips are a bit small, I think. No, I actually don't think I, I actually think Five I'm gonna throw up if I keep drinking. Like I'm shaking. Five more. Eight sips. Done. Mm. One more. I'm gonna like <sighs> take it. I, it just gives me such... I'm so repulsed by it. I'm not chugging it. Nutcracker, because I crack your nuts if you are near me. <laughs> you know, we have a lot in common. Me and a nutcracker. We have a lot in common. <laughs> she has a common. <laughs> have you ever met someone as funny as me? Jesus, I'm so funny. Hard rock. Are you hard? <laughs> I'm rock. I'm Russell. Ah, oh, my shoulder. Dislocated now. I'm not even kidding. That hurt. I was not ready. I was not prepared. Ah, oh, she. That looks nice.
It is like 5 p.m. It's like minus two degrees and it's pitch black. And I'm out on a bike ride to look at all the Christmas lights because I want to. Peep my bike out. Okay. Let's go. 